Hi guys, it's The Masked Haunter, and today we're going to unbox my my all-time favorite Spear Halloween animatronic, The Toxic Zombie. <laughs> if you've seen my uh, Halloween display video from last year, you probably have seen like a few seconds of this guy. Um, that was actually one I got last year, and it was totally destroyed after Halloween. So, I was without a toxic zombie for a while, but thankfully I found one on OfferUp, and for a good price actually, as well. And it said it was brand new, but I don't believe that. But, we'll find out if his LED eyes work, because the eyes on this thing are the, the worst thing ever. If they don't work, they don't work, and most of the time they don't work. So, let's find out, and let's unbox them. First we got some of the barrel poles, oh, that's pretty cool, everything's kind of clustered in here. Here is the toxic zombie himself, let's try and get him out here. Alright, there we go. There's the toxic zombie. Oh, dry rot. Probably don't want to mess with the latex. Then let's put them right here. Here we have his base. So has bolts in here. This is what YJ used to be back, used to do back in the day was with uh, um, screws and bolts. So cool. We got his the the lid here. It looks like his hand fell off. Probably have to super glue that back on. But it's supposed to look like this. Here we have the toxic zombie barrel and his AC adapter. So that's pretty cool. We'll put that right here. And I think we have. Yep, we do have the legs for the base. So, let's uh, clean up and uh, let's start setting them up. So ideally, we want to start with the base here. Let's take off the bolts. Okay, now we can put the toxic zombie on too. The base with uh, clothes getting out of the way too. Now all we have to do is uh, hold these back on so it doesn't fall over. Okay, so next we need to put on his legs. So let's do that. And there's a wire for the LED lights for the base. And we need to make sure that that's closer to the wire from coming from the toxic zombie. Yep, so right here we can easily that. Okay. Next up, we'll just put the rest of the legs on without breaking anything. <laughs> I think we need to go this way. Okay. And then we'll just put this one on the side. Next, we put on the barrel. So let's do that. Making sure that the slime uh, excess slime is on the, the top here. So let's do that. Okay, so let's face him this way. And let's, uh, now I believe we put on the, let me put this on first. So there should be like tiny little notches here where you put the barrel over and that should secure it on. There we go. Now let's put on these poles here, just making sure that this is facing this way. Trying not to get the fabric caught onto the pole here.
What is your favorite YJ animatronic? Let me know in the comments. Okay, so I think next we just uh, flip this up. I think. <laughs> yeah, they're very tight, so I won't be surprised if anything was. Yeah, anything was caught. So let's just flip this up. And Jim will lock these in here. And there is his, is his barrel. Cool. Thank God YJ has long cords, so you don't have to look for a <laughs> for a power outlet anywhere within a thousand feet. Okay, his hand fell off. Okay. Now let's uh, put this together and let's demo him for the first time. Of course, when uh, normally I think you would have to switch a on to adjust it, maybe. But I don't have time for that. All right, moment of truth. Let's plug him in. Zombie ready to go for the season. I will have a demo of him later. Thank you for watching. Stay scary and spooky.